All right, it's time to mount the XY table to the 20 inch drill press table. Uh, as you can see, the uh, the slots in the XY table do not align with the uh, T slots in the drill press table, so I'm going to have to make some sort of an adapter. I have a piece of uh, 6061 here. Uh, it's 12 inches by 18 inches, half inch thick. Uh, so I'm going to get started by cutting this up and uh, making an adapter plate. Alright, this is the setup I'm going with. I've uh, got the saw guide here, and I'm using a surfer saw with a carbide tip blade. This is going to be crazy loud in here, so I got my earplugs in. All right, I'll stay able to stay on the line pretty good. Now I was thinking I might have to put this in the middle and square it up, but uh, I think I'm it's good enough. I'm just going to go with that. Dress it up with the file a little bit. All right, I got the table centered on this piece of aluminum, so I'm just going to take a transfer punch and uh, get these holes marked out. XY table bolted to the plate and I've got to sit, sit down on here uh, but as you can see it sits down a little too low for the uh, this front wheel to uh, to turn all the way around so what I'm going to do next is I'm gonna go ahead and take this off and get these holes uh, drilled out for the t-slot nuts and uh, I'm gonna make some spacers lift this whole thing up a little bit
Alright, I got all the spacers made up. And I've got some made up some round nuts with some all thread. Alright, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, get everything cleaned up, put back together, and we'll see what it looks like. All finished. And that's about what I had in mind when I started. So I'm going to leave it set up just like this unless I have a reason to take it off. So another project in the books and on to the next one. So I'm going to leave it right there. And until next time, thanks for watching.